Okay. It's what? December 27th? December 27th. Um, this is my super cool new camera that I got for Christmas. It is the coolest freaking thing. Um, yeah, just wanted to pop in, say what's up. Still wearing my shirt from yesterday that Nikki, um, my fiance's little sister got me. She probably gives the best gifts ever. Um, but yeah, just wanted to kind of pop in, say what's up, say hello. Um, really, honestly, Christmas was all a crazy blur. Um, it was super, super jam-packed, super busy. Um, we've done a lot of things, so I took a little bit of shots of what was going on, what life was like. Um, but honestly, I just, I'm always stuck in between living your best life and not really having my camera out. Um, and between, you know, tape, you know, videoing everything and yeah, so enjoy these little clips that I did get. Not a lot, but just wanted to give you a little inside look. It was really fun. Okay, today is gonna be crazy. Um, it's literally Christmas Eve day. I'm running around, just picked up some snooze of breakfast. Uh, Jerome and I, we literally love the breakfast burrito. We always get some extra bacon in there because we're just meat lovers. Um, so yeah, so super excited. Just picked up some snooze. Um, we picked it up because it's just crazy chaos all the time. So we just always picked it up. Now I'm headed to Starbucks so that way Jerome can get his vanilla latte and I can get my hot chocolate because I am not a coffee fan at all. Um, but today is going to be really crazy, going to be really fun. The main kind of thing on our agenda is our annual Christmas Eve dinner that we have. Um, so I'm super excited for that. We have a couple appetizers that we need to make. We're actually going to make a homemade cheese bowl and then we're also going to make um, a really cool like Parmesan pinwheel, pesto pinwheel type thing. So stay tuned. It's going to be awesome. Tell me your favorite part about Christmas. I love opening presents. It is the day after Christmas. Um, Christmas is awesome. I I don't know. I want to get better at videoing what's going on in life. I don't know. But I just get so caught up in the moment that I don't want to, that I don't want to bring out my phone, that I don't want to bring out my camera, especially this badass new camera that you have got me for Christmas. It's a Canon power shot, some crazy thing. Um, so I'm so excited, but definitely link it in the bottom bar below because it's definitely what you have got me for Christmas. And I'm so grateful. So overall, it was a super awesome Christmas. I think it's always so much fun around the holiday season. Um, on the on Christmas Eve, we had a we had our annual Christmas um, dinner, which is at the Criados house, and it was it's honestly so much fun. Um, Valerie, she's a really well known baker. Um, she always throws the greatest like dinner parties. And so we had a nice uh, dinner party at her house. It was honestly beautiful. The food was so delicious. She had some fillets. She had some pork, oh, no, some lamb. Um, we, I also, this was the first time I ever tried cauliflower mashed potatoes, which were so delicious. You know, I'm like one of those like non-vegan, I love me kind of people. Um, so the, honestly, the mashed potatoes were so bomb because they were just so good. Um, so yeah, uh, it was honestly just such a good time. Had so much fun catching up. Um, it's just always so fun to be around family um, and especially Jerome's family because it's just so big um, with my family. It's literally just my brother, my older brother, my mom, and my dad, and it's just like always been us. Um, so celebrating with Jerome's family is so much fun because there's just so many dang peeps, literally. There's like, Val made a joke. She's like, hope y'all are ready. There's about 28 people coming. And I was like, so yeah, it was really fun. Um, and then fast forward to Christmas, we ended up spending that morning 
Mitzi Rum's mom, um, she made the best breakfast ever. Um, she made some like crepes with banana pudding and like roasted pecans and it was just so delicious, so good. Um, and then after that we headed over to Jerome's dad's house to go celebrate with Jerome's youngest brother. Uh, his name is Max and I want to say Max is 10? How old is Max, Jerome? I don't know, Jerome's gaming, Jerome's gaming. But he's around that age where, he, you know, Santa's real and he is real and all those things. Um, so it was just really, really fun seeing them, opening presents with them. Um, we ended up getting uh, Sandy, which is Jerome's stepmom, like the biggest case of Tito's um, you could imagine. We just, she loves Tito's and like we always love to give them just like corny kind of randomly weird gifts um because it's just so funny um because they you know you don't really know what to get parents as we get older they can just really get whatever they want um so we just like to give kind of gimmicky gifts and we honestly got her just a big old case of tito's which was the funniest thing um and then um i ended up getting some burks <laughs> some new Burks, which I love so much, um, and a lot of other cool stuff. Um, so yeah, and then we fast forwarded and we went back to Jerome's mom's house. And that's where we ended up playing Catan for the night. Um, I ended up gifting her Catan. Well, Jerome and I gifted her Catan because she just loves her board games. Um, but it was honestly so much fun because I've never played Catan. But when I went to school at Texas State, literally there were people that were obsessed with Catan and I just always wanted to play and so it was the perfect opportunity and then we played and I wanted to kill Jerome's siblings <sighs> like the competitiveness in the gaming like is just crazy in this household so it's honestly so funny Nikki ended up winning in general so it was just the best thing ever that that ends up happening overall it was just a super good um super super good little Christmas time with the fam um you know again I didn't really get a lot of pics or vids I don't know it's just I'm just always stuck in between you know do I take my phone out and now my super awesome camera out or do we just kind of enjoy the moment um so it's something I'm always like still kind of battling with but I'm very very grateful very very thankful for such an awesome holiday season um we ended up seeing my parents a little bit earlier that week and my mom is actually coming into town on saturday so that way we can hang out have like a little new year's time together um so i'm just really excited i'm very very grateful um it was a super super just wonderful holiday season um and i'm excited to see what this new year will bring um lots of fun stuff lots of good stuff in the making but yeah, honestly, uh, it was just a really, really good time. I am very, very happy, very, very thankful. Um, super, super just grateful for a really, really good holiday season, a really good Christmas. Um, whatever y'all celebrate, whatever you do, um, I just always like to keep family most important. And till the next time.